Hi everyone, welcome to my home studio. I'm Coach Kelly. Thanks for joining me today for a fabulous workout. Today's class, we're gonna get warmed up with the perfect 10 moves and then go right into some cardio and core and ab work and we'll do some loop band training for a lower body. Then the workout using light and heavy weights. We've got three moves for the upper body, three moves for the lower body, and then we'll have a finisher. So let's get warmed up and have a great workout. Thanks for joining me. <clears throat> let's start the workout with the timer set. So starting the session, this is the first 10 moves for, to warm up the body. There's some ability movement in here as well. So a few new things that we haven't done <clears throat> or that we've added on to the warm up. First, start with this squat and pull apart. As we've done in the past, sink down lower and pull that strap apart all the way. Squat, pull it apart. Squat, and then pull the strap apart. Squat, pull it apart. Bring it down. Weight in your heels. Just pull the strap apart. Do that one more time. And now do a reverse lunge like this, and then do a one leg back, one standing leg, touch the toes. Reach, and do that again, touch. So reach back, that leg back, reach the arms forward, then reach forward, now change sides. So let's do three on this side. Lunge, reach back, balance, lunge, and then reach, one more time, lunge, getting you set for balance right there. Excellent work. Now reach up and over and stretch overhead, touch your back, step side, touch your ankle. <clears throat> reach over, touch your ankle. Reach up and over, step side, touch. Reach up and over, and let's move a little quicker. Reach up and over, now we've got the move down. Reach, and then touch. Reach up and over, one more time. <clears throat> Excellent work. Now set this down, do a lizard with rotation. So foot over here, hand on the floor. Reach up, make a fist, and rotate under. Lift your knee and straighten that leg. Reach up, touch your shoulder, then reach up, touch your shoulder. Reach up and then touch. Reach and touch. Reach up and rotate. Reach, rotate, reach. One more. Set your knee down, hamstring stretch. Change sides. One foot on the floor, hand on the floor. Reach up, tuck your toes, lift your knee. Reach, rotate and touch your shoulder. Reach up and touch. So pointing the elbow towards the floor. <clears throat> reach, rotate, reach up, and then rotate one more time. Set your knee down and do a hamstring stretch right here. And we're gonna go into a 90-90 stretch. So sit on your mat, one shin forward, one shin side. <clears throat> Bring your hands in front of the shin and then lean forward. <clears throat> Lift up, bring the knees up and over, press your knees down, hands in front of the shin and lean forward for just a few seconds. Then lift up, bring it over and touch, hands on the floor, lean in. Lift up, reach the knees up and over, straight body, lean forward. One more time. And now come to the floor, feet on the floor, have Put your hands on the floor beside your, your hips. Lift up your hips, glute bridge, reach up. Arms overhead, turn your palms facing up. Then reach the arms to the side, palms facing down, lower the glutes. Do that again. Lift up, palms facing up as you hold the glutes. Then lower, palms facing down. Do it again. Lift up and reach, reach. And now lower, lower, lower. Now just flip all the way over on your mat. 
And let's do Superman. Lift up, Superwoman, lift up, and then bring the arms to the sides, reach forward, and then lower. Do that again. Up, arm side, reach, and lower. So lift up, arms to the side, reach, lower, lift, arm side, reach, lower, lift up, get those thighs up, reach, lift the chest, up, arm side, reach, and lower, lift. <clears throat> now slide your hands onto the floor, lift up, plank pose to downward facing dog. Plank pose, press your hands down, downward facing dog. Do it again, plank to downward facing dog. Breathe, plank, downward facing dog. Right there, come on. Plank, downward dog, bring it forward, and then downward dog. And then walk your feet in, stand up, and then do jumpy jacks. So low or high. Fingertips touch overhead, touch the side of your legs, press your heels out, keep going. Excellent work. So now grab your slider, your glider. <clears throat> Do a rear lunge, slide in, slide out, and stand up. Rear lunge, slide in, out, and up. Rear lunge, slide in, out, and up. Again, in, out, and up. Slide, slide in, and up. Use your arms like you're walking. Excellent work. Other side. So slide that leg back. Bend your knee. Slide it in. Hold that. Slide back and stand up. Now pick it up to tempo. Right there. So slide in, out, up. Slide in, out, up. Slide. <clears throat> slide, in, out, up. Do it again. Slide. One more. And now take this to the side right here. So side like this. So the outside hip bends and then the inside hip right there. Slide and then slide. So one go all the way out like that. And then hold, reach that leg side. Do it again. Slide, and then slide. Slide it out, bring it in. Nicely done. Now change sides. So it's two different moves. First, slide out, slide it in. And then bend your hip, that, that knee, and slide the foot. There you go. <clears throat> One, bring the leg out. One, bring the hip back. All right, that hip goes up, out. This hip stays right there. Do it again. Slide, 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 and then slide. Excellent work. Now let's do kind of like a pistol squat. So stepping on the ball of the foot on the, on the glider and go forward with a forward reach, slide. Now slide it forward, hold, lift the leg, put it down and slide in. Slide forward, lift, down and in. Slide, lift, down and in. Slide, lift, down and in. Two part, other side, here we go. So. Slide, just slide it right there. Press the ball of your foot down. Now, slide, lift, lower, bring it in. Slide, lift, lower, bring it in. Slide, lift, lower, 
in. Slide, lift, lower, bring it in, slide. Nice, go up. One more time. Nicely done. Now take it to the mat and place the band around your legs and above the knees. And let's just start with your feet together like this. Bend out and crunch our knees apart. Up and down, up, down. Shoulder blades up, elbows out. Lift up and lower, up. Now bring your legs together. Knees up 90 degrees, bicycle, touch, touch. So you've got that band around your legs, adding some intensity with the band and pulling those legs and thighs apart. Reach, reach, reach. <laughs> Keep going and breathe. Touch your elbow to your knee. Tap your elbow to the floor. Reach, 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 reach. Now set your feet on the floor. Hands on the floor. Lift up your glutes. Reach the arms overhead and tap the back of the hands to the floor. And then lower. Press your knees out the whole time. Up. And then lower. So your feet should be slightly closer in, or not too close in, but you want to have your lower back pressing down. And when you lift up, keep your back straight like that and reach. Now, just the glute bridge. Lift up and hold. Up and press your legs out and in. Out and in. Out and in. Press out, look straight up, reach the knees apart, press out, press your feet down solidly, press, 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 four more, three, two, and then one, lower down your back all the way, legs up straight, sit the legs apart and together. Maybe you move the strap a little bit closer to the knees to make it harder, out and in, but make sure it's flat. Flex your feet, turn your toes out slightly. Hands on the floor, reach, bring it together, reach, reach. Three, two, one, and now stand up. Come all the way up. <clears throat> Standing, flatten the band, make sure it's straight. Right above the knees. And then squat and take it laterally. Four, three, two, and one. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Four, three. Two, one. All right, so now take it four, step back. So you know four, don't bring your feet all the way together, but go back at a diagonal line, stepping back. So step out, step out, move forward, step out, and move back. Do it again. Step, tap, step, tap. Tap, tap, tap. Take it forward. All right, so now we're going to do a quicker movement. Take it to the side. We're going to take it laterally in that squat position, but go quick. Three, two, one. So it's a shuffle laterally. Do it again. Bring it back. Excellent. One, or lateral shuffle. Again, bring it side. One more. All right, walk it back. So quick movement, it's kind of like a skater. So 
Forward and back. Careful. And forward. And back. Come on. Forward. And back. And forward. And back. And now take off that band. Get rid of that. Now squat, lift your heels. Squat, hop. Squat, lift the heels. Squat and hop. Finishing. Final six moves. A little cardio. Get your heart rate up. Cardio hit. Up. Up. Down. Quick movement. Plyometric. And now we'll do some lateral hop. So listen to my cue. Stand on one leg. Hop to the other leg. Try not to touch down. Do it again like I just did. <laughs> again, hop. Hold. Hop. Three, two, one. Hold. Hop. One, two, three. Hop. One, two, three. Hop. One, two, three. Hop. Don't make it a side step. It's a hop on one leg. Hop on one leg. Hop on one leg. One more. Excellent work. Now a three count pulse and step to the other side. Three, two, one, or skip. Three, two, or one, and then hop. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Three. Excellent work. Go three, two, one. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Stand up. Tire run. So it's one, two, three. One, two, three. Use your arms. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Pick your feet up. Pick them up high. Lift that knee. On the other side, one, two, three. Both feet in, one foot out. Both feet in, one foot out. Keep going, two, three. Excellent work. Jumping jacks. Then plyometric. So bounce two times and then Squat. Two, one, hop. Plyo jack. Two. Keep going. We've got two more. Leg sweeps. Touch, touch, touch. Touch your toes or your shin. Just get your leg high. Touch. Sweep your arms. Make a circle like you're swimming. Palms facing up or palms facing in. And you're done. You're done with the warm-up and the beginning warm-up moves. Get some water. Move your stuff out of the way. Excellent work. Okay, catch your breath. Moving into strength training. Let's do three rounds. Upper body, three rounds lower body. The segments are, or the intervals are 20 seconds, three times, so on the minute exercises, one specific move, but we'll do right side and left side, and then put it together. So 20 seconds, starting the timer. All righty, pick up your 
heavy weight, right here, <clears throat> Arnold press. So press straight up and bring it down. So palms facing in and then palms facing forward. So this is developing the top of the shoulder right here. So we're on a quest to work on shoulder strength. And now alternate right side, left side, right side, left side, right side, left side, press it straight up, arm beside your ear. Now do a curl to a press. So curl to an Arnold press, down and then uncurl. Do it again. Curl, press, down, bottom. Curl, press, down, bottom. Curl, press, down, and then bottom. Set it down. The next move, lateral arms. So we've got 20 seconds, 30 seconds between the sets. You've got plenty of time to get water. So this is a lateral arm drill. First we'll do right side, and then we'll do left side. So working on the lateral part of the shoulders, the medial delt, or the medial, yeah, the medial delt. So to the side, and you wanna have the arm come to the side, straight up, but don't lift higher than your shoulder. Just that one side, and you can kind of slightly lean over the other direction. Now change the other side. Reach, arm side. Don't lift it higher than your shoulder. Palm facing down the whole time, right there. Lift, bring it up. And now we're gonna do it together, you ready? So straight arms, side and then lower. Resist coming down, lift up, lower, lift, and then lower, up, palms facing down, lift, do it one more time, excellent work. Now keep this weight. We're gonna go right into a rear fly. So I need you to lean forward like this, and you bend your knees and stick your glutes back there. Wait into, Weight in the heels, but then press into the balls of your feet. Pull your abs in. Bring the weight right in front of your belly. Right there, bend your knees really good and have a flat back so you're parallel to the floor. Lift up your arms to the sides. Resist coming down. And you're lifting up or bringing it out, but not back. So out to the sides. Don't lift higher than the shoulders. Now alternate. One side and then the other. One side and the other. Lift up. Arm side. Lift up. Now together right here. So lift up and go down three, two, one, do it again. Three, two, one. Nice. So back of the shoulders, your posterior delt. Lift up and slowly lower. Resist. One more. Excellent work. Let's go to glutes. All right. So now, legs and glutes. You'll grab your heavy weight again. Right, the right side, matrix lunge. We'll do a rear lunge, side lunge, and then forward on the right side. We'll stay on the right side first, and then we'll go to the left side. So hold your weight strong. Step back with the right leg. Step side, and you can reach the dumbbell. And then step forward, reach towards your ankle, and come back up. Do it again. Reach. Bring the weight up here. Reach. Bring the weight up. Lunge forward. Do it again one more time. Now take it to the other side. So lunge rear. Take it side. 
Take it forward. Take it rear. Take it side. Keep your balance. One more. And now let's alternate. So lunge rear. Take it side. Take it rear, or forward. And then change sides. Lunge rear. Take it side. Take it forward. And that's it. <laughs> Nicely done. And the next move, set your weights down for a moment, is a goblet squat. Solid minute, tempo change with each 20 seconds. <coughs> Let's do it. So pick up your weight, bring it up to your shoulders, or actually in front of the chest like this. Toes turned out slightly and go down to singles. Goblet squat. Keep your chest up. Hips go back, press your feet down and stand up. Good job. Or extend the legs straight. Squat, lift. Now go down four, four, three, two, one. Hold one, two, lift up. Do it again. Four, three, two, one. Hold one, two, and lift. Hold four, three, two, one. Hold one, two, and then lift. Now two down, two up. Two, two up. Two down, two up. Nicely done. Two down, two up. Press your feet down. Excellent work. Two down, two up. One more. Nicely done. So now the final move, lower body, single leg, RDL. I want you to hold two weights like this, and you're going to stand in your left leg and bring your hip back as you hinge and reach towards your shin and then come back up. If you can't do that, lower back problems, then just do a rear lunge and substitution, okay? So reach and come back up. If you keep your knee bent, it makes it easier. If you can get your leg more straight, but keep that hinging motion, chain sides. So either lunge rear or single leg RDL. And you don't want to reach in front of the shin, you want to reach close to the shin, so not far away. Main thing, but then also you don't have to go too low. And so now both legs, both feet on the floor, double row. So going from lower body to upper body. Bring it up. Lift, reach, lift, reach, up. Down, up. Excellent work. Set that down. Whoo! Okay, so let's go back, go through it all one more time. Three moves upper body, three moves lower body. So starting with ah, heavy weight for the overhead press. So we'll do it in different order, in a different order this time. Just to change it up, so palms facing the ears, hold the weight strong, and alternate right and then left. Press up. And you want to shift your weight kind of forward right there in that front foot. That front leg's working, stabilizing, or change sides like this. Same thing, but changing sides. All right, so now... Arnold press, facing your, your chest, turn it out facing forward. And when you reach the arms overhead, it's like you're looking through a window and you can't see the sides of your arms. All right, so now bicep curl to overhead press. Bring it down, again, curl, press, bring it down, and then down all the way down, up, reach, 
down, and then bottom. Nicely done. Set your weights down. Lighten up. You need to be at much lighter weight for lateral arms, both lateral arms and also the reverse fly. So standing. Let's start with the right arm to the side. And you want to have your abs contracted. Press your feet down so you're engaged in your body. And we'll start with our right side. Lift and then lower. Lift and lower. Slow and controlled. You want to descend using your strength to resist that negative or the down movement, the eccentric part of the movement. Change sides, up and then down, up, then down. Good job. Up, lower, lift, lower, again, lift, lower, press your feet down, up, together. You ready? Side and then lower, up, lower. Excellent work. Nicely done. Set it down for a moment. Get some water. And then we'll do rear fly. So again, you need light weight. And I'll face you this time. So you got a few seconds. Hinge forward with a flat back. Look down. Send your hips back. Take it to the side. You can alternate right here. Alternate. Lift to the side. Don't bring it back. Working the posterior deltoids, the back of your shoulders. Now together. On the minute with three variations. Called EMOM on the minute, every move on the minute, reach, and now alternate it again one more time. Nicely done. Come on, straight arm, maybe slight bend in your elbow. Excellent work. Done with the upper body. Transition to the lower body. So grab your weights. The matrix lunge, it's a lot. Just pay attention. We'll start with the right leg. So rear lunge, side lunge, and then forward lunge. And we'll reach the dumbbells also to add intensity and upper body work. So bring the weight up to your shoulders. Step back. Reach towards your ankle, step side, and forward. Do it again. Reach back with your leg, side, forward. Excellent. Other side. Reach, side, and then forward. Again, same side. Reach side. Reach forward. Go back to the other side. We'll do one on each side to finish. Other side. Lunge. Lunge. Forward. Set it down. Get your water. All right. Goblets. Goblet squats. Two weights are one. I'm going to go ahead and grab my two weights. 
Way right here. Toes turned out. Elbows in. Squat. Singles. Hips go back. Smooth out that point at the bottom that's tough. Push your feet down. No good on for four, three, two. Hold one, two, and then up. Go four, three, two, one, one, two, and up. Four, three, two, one, one, two. Do it again. Four, three, two, one, one, two. Now two, two up. Two down, two up. Two down, two up. Two down, two up. Come on. Two down, two up. Excellent work. Set it down. Single leg RDL. Make sure you're doing it right. When you reach the weights towards your leg or down, make sure you're close to the leg, like this close, not far away. That'll hurt your back for sure. Okay, so pick up your weights. I'll face you this time. Standing leg. Reach and then come back up. Good. So it's right side and left side, and then we'll do some double lat row. So engaging the lats at least for a couple of sets. Here we go. Now the other side. Reach, front of the shin, and then come up. Do it again. Strengthening that standing leg. If you fall over, it's okay. Just adjust, come back up again. Excellent work. Double row. Pull it to your hips right there. Reach in front of the knee or to the side of the shin right there. Up. Bring it up. Come on. One more. Nicely done. Please set your weights down and get some water. Wipe your sweat and let's stretch. So seated, both legs out like this and roll down all the way. Place your right ankle on your left knee. Put your hands on the floor as you recover Breathe in deeply and fully exhale. So keep your foot on the floor. Press your knee away for five, four, without using your hand, three, two, one, and release. Do that again. Five, four, three, two, one, and then release. Do that again. Hold it for five, four, three, two, one. One more time. Press away for five, four, and then release. Now lift up the legs, feed your hands through, thread the needle, grab around the hamstring, and then push your knee away. Rotate your left foot. Rotate the other way. And then set your left foot on the floor. Bring your arms out to the sides. Tip your knees over to the right. Turn your head to the left. And lift your knees and bring that right knee in. Extend the left leg out straight. Extend the right leg up straight. Reach up and grab your calf and pull the leg in. Point and flex your foot. And then hold, lift your shoulder blades up, lift up the left leg and hold, and then switch legs, opposite leg in, and lower the leg, lower your shoulders, and we'll start here with the leg up straight. We'll go the opposite direction through those moves on this other side. 
So pull the leg in, point and flex your foot. Then bend your knee, pull the leg in, then place your right, your left ankle on your right knee, move the ankle bone over to the side, flex your foot, reach through, grab the knee, rotate your right foot, rotate the other direction. And then set the foot on the floor, arms to the sides, press the knee away and hold for five, flex your foot, four, Three, two, one, release. Do it again, flex and reach away. Five, four, three, two, one, release. Again, press away. Five, four, three, two, one, and release. Do it two more times. Flex, press away. Five, four, three, two, one, and release. One more time. Five, four, three, two, and one, and release. Everyone roll over onto your side. Come onto your hands and your knees, and do cat cow cat. Press your hands down like you're going to unscrew caps. Cow, cat, and cow, cat, and then cow. One more time. Now tuck your toes, lift your knees up, walk your hands back to your feet. And then bend your right knee, straighten your left leg. Walk your hands over to the left side and hold. And you can press your hands into the floor like that on that side and hold for three, two. Stay with me. One, bend your left knee, straighten the right leg, walk your hands over to the right side. And hold, press your hands down, press your foot down, hold it for three, two, one, and then hands to the thighs, stand up and lift your arms up overhead, reach up. Grab your wrist and then step behind that same side and press your feet down and lean over and back right there. Press your hips out, reach the arms, press your feet down. Here's eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one, and reach. Other side. Reach for your wrist, pull it over, press your feet down, reach the hip to the side, draw the shoulder back. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, reach. Arms down. Excellent works. So good to have you with me today. Thanks so much for getting your workout done and let me know about your experience, how you're doing. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for showing up.